Hello, you wonderful people, and greetings from a bus station in Japan. You know, on this channel, I've done a lot of videos showing off exclusive sodas that have premiered out here in Japan. I believe I did a Mountain Dew Violet, I did Coca-Cola Clear, Coca-Cola Clear Lime, and you know what? I just found out that Pepsi has released something called Pepsi Pineapple. Pepsi with pineapple inside of it. Now, it's a hot day, and I'm sure a bus stop will be a perfect place to drink this. However, I believe I know one place that I could drink a unique Japanese cola in style. And folks, we're going there now. And greetings from Orange Street in a place called Asakusa. And I know what you're thinking. Orange Street, this is the place you come to drink Pepsi pineapple? Well, it's not what's on Orange Street that I want to see. It's what's down this way. The oldest shrine in Tokyo, Sensoji. And if you can't drink a Pepsi pineapple in style there, well, I guess you can't do it at all. Opened around the year 600, this place is one of the most popular temples to come visit in all of Japan, and the oldest one in Tokyo. It's also a huge tourist trap. And if you wanna come see this, I highly recommend coming in the afternoon or evening where it's not as busy. To get to the main part of the temple, you have to walk through Nakamise Shopping Street, which is full of shops. But in the evening, they have a lot of artwork on their shops, which is kind of cool because you're not being heavily advertised to and you get to see a little bit of Japanese art. But that large shopping street makes the lead up to this temple absolutely amazing. Inside this giant temple lies the goddess Kanan, the goddess of mercy. And unfortunately the doors are closed right now, but you can still go up and pray. The only mercy I want from the goddess Kanan is a break from this terrible summer heat. So let's get this J. Cola Pepsi Pineapple open, shall we? Now let's take a look at this bottle first. So we got Japan Cola Pepsi Pineapple. That's all you need to know, a bunch of information on the back. and. Basically, it's a uh, Japan Cola, and uh, I bought it from Eon, which you can find this in supermarkets and not in vending machines. Just a heads up on that. Let's open her up. Sweet. Notice it doesn't explode all over my hands. That's a good sign. If you take a whiff of this soda, you'll have a pineapple-y odor gashing out from it. This whiff of pineapple reminds me of a drink they have out here called Chuhai with pineapple, which is an alcoholic fruity drink that, man, tastes amazing. Oh look, it's the protector of children with a bunch of cranes that were made, hopefully for a positive wish. I think I can drink this underneath the Buddha's big shoes right there. I'll pick that one over there. All right, here we go. Wow, it tastes like Pepsi with an overloaded artificial pineapple flavor. But man, it tastes really good and it, it kind of hits the spot. There's a lot of like sugar. It doesn't taste like real um, pineapple, but it tastes like, you know when you bite into a pineapple slice and all the juice kind of like flies out of it? It tastes like that. This is really good, but I still think the Coca-Cola Clear Lime is better. While historically extremely interesting and a wonderful place to down a delicious beverage, such as this Pepsi Pineapple, I can think of one other place I'd like to go. Across the river right there, that's the Asahi Beer Hall, and on top of it is a golden flame. But some people say it looks like a golden piece of poop. So they call it the Golden Poop, or the King Unko, I believe. I may be destroying that name, but I can't think of a better place to drink a Pepsi pineapple rather than from a golden piece of poop. That isn't to knock this drink. I think it's very, very good. However, I think that Coca-Cola Clear Lime is a clear contender for this. However, if you want a little more of this experience, look for a Chuhai drink that has pineapple in it and alcohol in it, and it's better. This is like the kid's version of that. 
Now, I hope you guys enjoyed these series of videos where I did some summer reviews on the drinks that have been released out here in Japan. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a thumbs down and tell me why you didn't like it. And if you really like the video, make sure you subscribe. As I always say, you can do it. I can do it. We can all do it. Stay groovy and have a wonderful day. Peace. Seriously, this is a pretty good drink. And that's a big, giant piece of poo.